Solana meme coins are super popular right now and in this video I'm going to show you how to create your own meme coin on Solana in five minutes or even less. So I'm going to show you two methods because basically you can go with Dexlab which is the faster way but also more expensive one or you can have a look at my tutorial uh, on Gumroad where we have the full tutorial with the full code you don't pay you pay just only $100 to get in and get access also to the secret discord with everyone helping you around uh, and all the code or we can go with the first method we're going to start with Dexlab uh, and I'm going to show you how to do it quickly and what are the costs but basically the costs are very similar you will be, you will have to spend around 0.5 sol to go with Dexlab uh, that's why I think uh, it's appealing if you want to do uh, more tokens or if you want to do it yourself uh, then going with uh, my uh, Gumroad tutorial is probably the better way uh, to start uh, we're going to start with Dexlab so if you click on create token uh, you basically will be taken right away to create a token and it's as simple as that so the only thing you have to do is choose SPL token because this is when uh, you will be able to then create the market on Radium Radium is the uh, top place to provide liquidity or you can choose Meteora as well now uh, as you can see it's really as simple as that once you connect your wallet so you have your phantom wallet uh, it's all about just putting the token name uh, symbol description you can add your things like website twitter telegram group discord add additional tags and then upload an image that will represent your meme coin and basically uh, after you click everything you just have to uh, connect your wallet uh, and that's going to be it uh, and then you can choose also the quantity of the token important stuff here is that uh, you already will have a uh, freezing authority uh, revoked uh, minting revoked that will be the, the next step uh, and also make sure that you burn LP in the end so after adding LP to the radium if you click of course all the links will be down below in the description uh, the next thing after creating a token is creating a market for it on Radium. And this is where you put uh, your token address here uh, against the soul. Uh, so that's called. Uh, here you can go with, for example, uh, free, uh, free. That's the, the usual uh, thing that you can do uh, for the minimum order size in price tick. But also there are other options depending on how many decimals there are in your, uh, uh, in your uh, token. But if there are three decimals, then free free will be fine. Uh, and you can choose open book plus radium or just radium if this uh, uh, th this is usually also just fine and this will be cheaper but still you will have to pay around 0.5 sol here and in the previous step as well 0.2 or something uh, and on top of that you will have to pay on um, uh, on radium additional fee of 0.5 so the total cost with going with the Dexlab option is around two so uh, some of that cost will of course uh, will always appear because you have the cost of radium which is around uh, I think uh, one sol altogether if you go with the cheapest option of creating a ra radium pool like that without the open book because otherwise you will have to have at least three sol and that's basically it you can create the tokens like that with Dexlab uh, in a matter of like couple of minutes if you want to go fast uh, just putting everything here uh, really you don't need to know any coding to do that so that's really cool and in the worst case you can always read the tutorial here uh, to learn more about this creating market because I think that's the most confusing part here how to create the market on radium uh, but of course radium is only one of the options you can also go with Meteora where you don't have to create the market uh, but also there are less people for some reason trading with radium uh, than on Meteora but uh, Meteora is basically as fine as radium when it comes to uh, when it comes to decentralized exchange when you can put your meme coin now I also wanted to mention briefly uh, my tutorial here because I think it's worth comparing you basically pay with the current prices uh, 0.5 so uh, $100 and you get all the code and from the very beginning of how to create and how to interact with Solana meme coin uh, Solana blockchain and create your own meme coin of course it's better if you coded anything before because otherwise you will have to learn a lot and that will definitely take you especially in the beginning at least a couple of hours or even a couple of days to get started but the good thing is that if you want to do multiple meme coins then you don't have to you 
you know, you just have the cost of the gas, which are very minuscule, maybe creating the market, you don't have to pay multiple times per creating a wallet. So in the end, that's a cheaper option to go. Plus you have the community that I've mentioned, you will be uh, automatically invited to the Solana dev community uh, with close to 100 people right now. Uh, so that's pretty cool. Uh, and I think uh, it's definitely worth uh, taking a look in the end. You can also watch my uh, shorter tutorial on what's really covered inside. If you go through the link, uh, of course, the link will be provided down below in the description. So altogether, uh, I think we live in this golden period of meme coins. So it's definitely worth checking out at least how to do them. Uh, and DexLab is probably the fastest way to do it right now and the easiest to use. If you don't want to code anything yourself, uh, then DexLab provides you with everything you might might need to and might want to, but of course they have their own fees to do everything. So you have to take that uh, into consideration. And of course, if you want to do that multiple times, uh, then those co those costs can be substantial. Uh, so this is really it. Thank you for watching, subscribe to the channel and see you in the next video.